Well, school is out and summer is officially here. And much like today, I'm sure the sun is out today as well as the heat. So how are we gonna help each other out here? Well, obviously we're gonna head on over to one of Greeley's mini pools and outdoor pools and splash pads that we have available for you to help cool you off and so that you can enjoy some of that summer fun. And here to tell us a little bit more about our splash pads and our pool areas around Greeley. For those of you who may not know, we have Natalie Gonzalez, who is a recreation supervisor here with the city of Greeley. Natalie, great to have you here. Yeah, thanks for having me. Okay, now something that I am, I'm personally kind of excited about, and that is for the pools this year, we have some extended hours. So tell us more about that. Yeah, so we're extending our hours out here at Centennial and then at Discovery Bay as well. So we'll be open from 12 to 6 for open swim. Um, and then our splash parks will be open 11 to 7. So a lot of opportunities for families to get out there, especially after work, when it's still nice and hot out. Take a quick dip before dinner and then go home and relax and enjoy your evening. Exactly, and that was one, one of the reasons why I was excited. I know that uh, for many years, that when we after we moved here to Greeley, um, that I was like, wow, the pool's closed at 5. I'm like, oh. But this is, this is I'm excited about because now we can come in the evenings and cool down a little bit and just, you know, kick back and, and de-stress, which I think is always a good thing. Now, you mentioned that we're here at Centennial Pool, which is along 23rd Avenue and, uh, and also Discovery Bay. And that's located a little bit more on the east side of town. Yeah, correct. Off of First Street okay. by Bella Romero. Okay, and both of these are very popular areas for folks to go to. Um, now, you mentioned about the hours. We've got that 12 to 6 p.m., and that's seven days a week, or what, what are the days of the week that they're open? Yep, so that's seven days a week, consistent across the board, Monday through Sunday. Okay, now, there's also, um, outside of just coming and enjoying yourself here at the pools and, and enjoying the slides and the splash pads and everything that the pools have to offer, um, we also have some events that are going to be happening at the various um, swimming pools in the area. So one of them, as you mentioned, we've got Discovery Bay Water Park, and on Wednesdays, there's going to be some family nights. Yeah, so we're extending hours till 8 p.m. so that families can come in and enjoy that time. Um, we'll probably have some special events out there um, that are coming soon um, that we're still in the works, but we are also partnering with our youth enrichment um, to make sure we have that play on the way trailer out there and some other opportunities for um, people to enjoy themselves. Sounds like a great time. So again, that's Wednesday nights for family nights at Discovery Bay from 12 to 8. And then here back at Centennial um, on Thursdays, we've got some special times and events happening as well. Yeah, so Thursdays will also be open for our family swim, so we'll be open until 8. Um, but we are going to throw some different things in here. So we'll have the Wibbit, which is our inflatable obstacle course, mm -hmm. which the kids love, and it's a lot of fun to get out here and do that. Yep. Um, we will also have Movie in the Pool on July 14th. So that'll start at dusk. But outdoors will open at 7:30. Um, Sexy Sammy's will be here as a sponsorship, so their food truck will be here. Um, then we'll have some popcorn and different things like we always do. So. And what's always important to know when it comes to that swimming night for the movie is the movie, and that will be The Sandlot. Yeah. So kicking it back a little bit, great. but it's a great movie, and we're really excited, especially with the ball fields across the street. Just yeah. summer feel. Perfect. You're, you've got this all figured out. Now, something I want to mention as well, uh, for those who may not know, um, Greeley also has a couple of splash pads. Now, these are free, um, and folks can go to those, and you've also got some extended hours for those this year. Yeah, so instead of that 12 to 4, we're actually going 11 to 7 this year. Mm -hmm. So at Sunrise and Island Grove, that is also seven days a week. So we'll have those extended. Those are free. We do not have staff there, so it's kind of run and play at your own risk. But it's a great opportunity for families to enjoy some free water time. Now, you just mentioned some lifeguards. There's also a chance for uh, folks if or kids, maybe it's kids, it could be, could be for anybody, I guess, yeah. but to uh, maybe have that great summertime job as a lifeguard. Yeah, absolutely. We're always looking for lifeguards and looking to extend our staff. So if you're interested, hop on Oracle and apply. Okay, now, as I mentioned before with those splash pads, those are free, but here at Centennial and Discovery Bay, there is a fee for entrance. Um, can we give us the highlights on those and make sure that people are prepared when they show up? Yeah, so we have our um, daily fee, which is our $5 for adults, $4 for youth and senior, and $1.50 for anyone under two. But we also have a punch pass option as well. So our punch passes um, are for 10 punch in, 
punches, it is $32. Okay, all right. Well, we've covered a lot of ground today. And of course, all of this is available on the Greeley, Greeley's website at GreeleyRec.com. So Natalie, thank you so much for being here today and uh, stay cool out there. Yeah, thanks for having me. All right, so as we mentioned, we've got lots of opportunities. Head on over, cool off at one of our great pools here in Greeley. Enjoy some of those special events. The movie night sounds great. Gotta love the Sandlot. And in the meantime, if you need more details or you can't remember all of this, head on over to GreeleyRec.com.